At the release of HCL Portal 9.5, a new container deployment option is now available. This video will demonstrate how to download, import, and run a Portal 9.5 container. To run the container, I will use Docker Desktop for Mac. You can easily find this by just searching for Docker Desktop. Once the Docker installer has finished downloading, run the installer and follow the prompts. Once Docker Desktop is running, you can easily verify that it installed successfully by running the docker version command. Once we verify the docker desktop is installed, we will need to download the portal container. We can do this by going to the HCL software portal. In the portal, you'll see the HCL portal 85995CFs. In this directory, you'll find the latest CF for the container. As of April 2020, the latest CF is 173. Once a container has finished downloading, unzip the file. If we refer to the Docker documentation, the image that we're going to use in Docker is the core image. The command we're going to use to import the file per the portal documentation is the docker load command. Once the image has been loaded, you can run the docker image ls command to confirm. Now that the image is available, we can create and run a new portal container. If you look back at the documentation, it'll list the ports that we need to publish. I've already copied out the command and this is the command I'm going to run, uh, docker container run. Um, D for detach, and then the publish flag with all the ports. Uh, the name of my uh, container will be portal 95. And I'm going to go ahead and create a volume and map it into the WP profile directory. And then this is the tag of the image. Once you see the containers created, it will take a few minutes for portal to start up. In the meantime, we can log in and check the log. To do this, we're going to use the docker exec command. Once the portal server finishes loading, you can access it using the local host and the portal port.
This concludes this short demo on how to get started with Portal using Docker. Mm -hmm.